How to start a lemonade stand. It's hot out. You like money. How about starting a lemonade stand? You will need an adult to help, lemonade, a serving pitcher, ice and an ice bucket, a sign, a table, a tablecloth, paper cups, some money to make change, a box for your money, and a big smile. Step one. Before you make your lemonade, make a business plan. Will you have to spend any money on supplies? If you're going to spend $5 of your own money on ingredients, for example, you'll need to make more than $5 to make a profit or the money you get to keep. Now you can decide how much you want to charge per cup to make sure you earn that. Remember, if you're setting up shop with other people, you'll have to split the money you make with them. Step two, pick the perfect day, time, and location for your lemonade stand. Think about where and when the largest number of thirsty people would walk by your stand. Think hot days at playgrounds and fairs or during Little League games. Of course, your front yard is just fine too. Step three, make your lemonade sign using some cardboard or foam core and a large bold marker. Write, lemonade for sale, with the price clearly visible. You can add a drawing of lemons or a glass of lemonade if you want. The bigger and flashier your sign, the more people will notice it. Step four, while walk-in customers are usually the bulk of lemonade stand business, you might want to let your friends and family know what you're up to. You can either make flyers or do an email blast announcing the time, location, and date of your grand opening. Step five, make your lemonade ahead of time. You can make it from a mix, but serving homemade lemonade will make your stand special and might help you sell more. Either way, have a grown-up cut up a lemon so you can float the slices in your pitcher. For one gallon of homemade lemonade, ask an adult to juice six lemons, then mix that with one and a half cups of sugar and two quarts of water and ice. Step six, now comes the fun part, drink it. You've gotta make sure it tastes good, but don't drink too much or you'll have to mix up some more. Step seven, pour the lemonade into a large thermos or several pitchers and refrigerate it until you're ready to start selling. Step eight, set up your table. You can use a folding table or some milk crates with boards on top. On top of this, set a clean tablecloth and lots of cups. Hang or prop up your sign. Make sure everything looks clean. The cups, table, pitcher, and even you. Step nine, depending on what you're charging, you'll want to either have lots of quarters or single dollar bills to make it easy to make change for your customers. Keep the money safe and organized in some kind of box on the table. If there are other stands in your area, try to make yours stand out. Put the words gourmet or secret recipe on your sign. Step 10, store extra ice and lemonade in separate containers under the table so you won't have to run back to the kitchen and fill a see-through serving pitcher with some ice, lemonade, and cut lemons. Don't set out cups already filled with lemonade. Flies will swarm around them and it will look gross. Step 11, smile and wait for customers. People like to buy from kids that smile. Did you know? In 2003, a six-year-old boy started a lemonade stand to raise money for breast cancer research. Today, Max's Lemonade Stand is a nonprofit that's made over $30,000.